Hi guys, so today I thought I'd do something which is a little bit of a video today. So yes, I just woke up because I just woke up. Wow, that's very confusing. But anyway, I thought I'd do a bit of an unedited kind of like stream of consciousness video today. Um, is that what it's called? I'm not sure, but basically it's where you just like sit and talk in a video about random stuff and you just talk about whatever comes out your head. So I have something else I want to do today. I'm folding laundry up right now because, as you can see here, there's loads of laundry. So I need to obviously um, fold that up, so that's what I'm going to do right now, and then chat with you guys. So, it's not really very edited or very sort of YouTube -y. Either it is edited or it's very sort of minimally edited. Um, we'll see about that, but, um, yeah, so... Uh, I've got loads of laundry because what I do normally is I'll leave the laundry to like last minute. Like I'll leave to like the laundry basket that gets like really really full. To the point where like the lid doesn't close. And so I decide, you know what, yeah I think I do need to put some laundry in the washing machine. So that's what I did and there's like piles of washing. Um, so I'm going to put that away right now. So... Um, yeah, so, when I'm unfolding underwear, so you guys don't need to see that, so, um, yeah, but yesterday I went to, um, a Liverpool, um, for, um, a look around, and I had somewhere to eat as well, and one of the things I hate about myself is that normally out of habit, if somebody, like, comes to me, like, food and says, oh, enjoy your meal, you know how sometimes people say, oh, enjoy your night, and then someone will be like, oh yeah, thank you, you too. Like, I do, I do that all the time, but one thing about me is I'll say it during, like, a meal. So, if someone, like, passes me down a meal, like, pasta or something, they'll say something like, here you go, enjoy your pasta. And I'll, and, I'll, and I'll be like, thank you, you too. <laughs> what is that habit? Like, that is the most strangest thing ever because they have nothing to enjoy because, um... All they're doing is just like waiting in a hot kitchen and serving food all day. So I don't know what they're going to enjoy, but it's just a really strange habit I have, which I need to kind of try and get rid of. Um, is there anything else to do that, or is that just the me thing? Is that, like, is that a universal thing? I don't know. But, um, yeah, I've got those like, really weird socks, which um, I think I actually bought once for... Uh, I'm trying to think. I bought it for something. I've just been wearing them ever since. Um, I've got the, those from Morrison's, I think. They're like different coloured socks. So I've got orange, got another shade of blue. I think I've got green as well. But these socks normally were like a last resort. So I've no, I've no other clothes because I've left the clothes to like not wash. Like I've left more than one large basket ready to wash. The last were these socks and. Um, that's not very good. Um, um, yeah, so what else do I talk about? Oh, my room is kind of a little bit of a mess right now, and I'm going to tie it up as well in a bit, but um, yeah, but you guys, like, a few days ago, I had kind of like a depressive kind of day where I just like sat in bed and I just kind of. Um, I just like ate snacks kind of all day, hence the messy end table. Um, because I just couldn't be able to do anything. Um, so that's what happened. Wow, that's a voice so croaky. Um, <clears throat> but, um, yeah, that's the teeth. Oh, oh my god, there's so many clothes, guys. Like, how have I not washed all these clothes? Like, how does all these clothes fit in the washing machine drum thing? I do not know. Because all this was washed in, like, one go. And so I have no idea how my shirt make it fit in the washing machine drum, but... I guess... <laughs> mm. Yeah, okay, that's largely my underwears and socks um, done with. And there are still bits like socks left to fold. <laughs> there we go. I was about to put this thing in the wrong pair of socks then because 
I have this colour socks, smells of this colour socks as well, so I often get mixed up with different with these different colours, so I'll have rather odd socks indeed. These are my work trousers. Nothing really Hi guys, so today I thought I'd do something which is a little bit of a video today, so yes I just woke up because I just woke up. Well that's a bit confusing, but anyway. I thought I'd do a bit of an unedited kind of like stream of consciousness video today. Um is that what it's called? I'm not sure, but basically it's where you just like sit and talk in a video about random stuff and you just talk about whatever comes out of your head, so I have something else I want to do today. I'm folding laundry up right now because as you can see here, there's loads of laundry. So I need to obviously um, fold out, so that's what I'm going to do right now and then chat with you guys. So it's not really very edited or very sort of YouTube y. Either it is edited or it's very sort of minimally edited. Um, we'll see about that. But um, yeah, so uh, I've got loads of laundry because what I do normally is I'll leave the laundry to like last minute. Like I'll leave it to like the laundry basket that gets like really, really full point where like the lid doesn't close and sort of side. You know what, yeah, I think I do need to put some laundry in the washing machine. So that's what I did and there's like piles of washing. Um so I'm gonna put that away right now. So um yeah so right now I'm unfolding underwear so you guys don't need to see that so um yeah but yesterday I went to um a Liverpool um, for um, a look around and I had somewhere to eat as well and one of the things I hate about myself is that normally out of habit if somebody like comes to me like food and says oh enjoy your meal you know how sometimes people say oh enjoy your night and then someone will be like oh yeah thank you you too like I do, I do that all the time but one thing about me is I'll say it during like a meal so if someone like passes me down a meal like pasta or something, they'll say something like, here you go, enjoy pasta, and I'll, and I'll, and I'll be like, thank you, you too. <laughs> what is that habit? Like, that is the most strangest thing ever because they have nothing to enjoy because um, all they're doing is just like waiting in a hot kitchen and serving food all day. So I don't know what they're going to enjoy, but it's just a really strange habit I have, which I need to kind of try and get rid of. Um, is there anything else to do that or is that just the me thing? Is that, like, is that a universal thing? I don't know. But, um, yeah, I've got those like, really weird socks, which um, I think I actually bought once for... Uh, I'm trying to think. I bought it for something and I've just been wearing them ever since. I've um, got those from Morrison's, I think. They're like different coloured socks. So I've got orange, got another shade of blue. I think I'm called green as well, but these socks normally were like a last resort, so I've no I have no other clothes because I've left the clothes to like not wash. Like I've left more than one large basket ready to wash. The last wear these socks and um that's not very good. Um, um yeah, so what else do I talk about? Oh, my room is kind of a little bit of a mess right now, and I'm going to tie it up as well in a bit, but, um, yeah, but you guys, like, a few days ago, I had kind of like a depressive kind of day where I just, like, sat in bed, and I just kind of, um, I just, like, ate snacks kind of all day, hence the messy end table, um, because I just couldn't be able to do anything. Um, so that's what happens. Wow, that's a voice so croaky. Um, <clears throat> but, um, yeah, that's the teeth. Oh, oh my god, there's so many clothes, guys. Like, how have I not washed all these clothes? Like, how does all these clothes fit in the washing machine drum thing? I do not know. Because all this was washed in, like, one go. And so I have no idea how my shirt make it fit in the washing machine drum, but I guess it 
Okay, that's largely my underwears and socks um, done with. And there are still bits like socks left to fold. <laughs> there we go. I was about to put this thing in the wrong pair of socks then because I have this colour socks and also this colour socks as well, so I have to get mixed up with different with these different colours, so I'll have rather odd socks indeed. These are my work trousers. Nothing really. So my camera just like ran out of memory, so I had to sort out but yeah, like I said, I used to put t-shirts in the tall boy, like my fabric and cotton t-shirts, but the only problem with that was is that it became incredibly creased. Where I'd have to take it out and iron it because I folded it to put it in the drawer. And so I ended up just like swapping the t-shirts and putting them in the wardrobe so they say not creased. Um, so that's uh, something I guess. Um, oh, I've got this thing here, and this thing's honestly the coziest thing ever, like, I got this from Primark when I went to Manchester the other day and this thing so freaking cosy. I love it so much. Um got some more socks to on um, to put on. Does anybody else do this when you put the socks like this? So have you like that and then just like tuck it in, like rub it and do that. I've always done that for years. You know, I think actually someone taught me how to do that, actually, so that's why I've, I do it. <clears throat> right, these are my sports t-shirts, so they go on the draw, obviously. Okay, so what am I doing today? Um, today is just a day where I just get things done because, um, yeah. So I, might, I might go for a walk very soon, but the only problem with that was it was like nice and sunny before, but just like this minute, like it was absolutely about to get down with rain on like when it was like sunny and it has like blue skies, but it's like raining at the same time. Like, it's that, like, kind of weather, which is, like, just changing, like, every second. Um, yeah. Um, <laughs> <laughs> I got this green bag. Can you not see if there's anything in this green bag? Do you want to know the reason why I got this, like, green bag? Uh, why I bought it originally? Well, I think you guys probably know already, because I've vlogged about it once, I think, but... I got sick in my other navy blue bag, so what happened was I went to um, Pizza Hut one day, I was going out somewhere, and I ate the pizza, the pizza, and, and, uh, uh, and normally the pizza from Pizza Hut is like really filling, so um, if you've been to Pizza Hut before then you know that a pizza can be quite filling and you can easily feel sick from all the pizzas, it's just like bread and cheese, which is like carbohydrates so that can make you sick sometimes and um, so I ate too much pizza and there uh, I decided to eat loads of ice cream you know from like the ice cream factory thing that they have well I decided to eat like three bowls of ice cream from the ice cream factory because I was trying to take advantage of the ice cream buffet thing so I thought oh well I'll sure I'll be fine eating three bowls of ice cream well, I got to town because I needed to go somewhere in town. So I'm actually at the, and I could just feel myself like being sick. Like I felt so sick anyway. Like I felt like I wanted to die, kind of. Um, but you know what the feeling when you're about to be sick, like you're about to vomit, and you get that like, I don't know, is that feeling in your mouth and feeling like right down there that something's about to come up. Well, I felt that, so I thought, oh my god, I'm about to be sick. So, why do I be sick? I was like, I'm going to be sick on the pavement, which would have been quite embarrassing. Or, I could empty my navy blue bag out and just be sick in there. So, I decided to just be sick in my navy blue bag because, to be, to be honest, it was quite a good bag, but it was it was only like £5 from like Tesco thing, and I got that like many years ago. 
So, and I was about to actually get a new bag anyway, because I didn't like that, that navy blue bag, because it didn't really match any outfits or anything like that. Like, it was just like a old navy blue bag, which I got from Tesco, like, about many, many years ago, actually. It was like, only £5, so um, I was glad to be rid of that bag. Um, but yeah, um, yeah. Okay, so now for my bed linen, so I'm going to change my bed linen um, very soon because um, I want to kind of like clean my room, uh, make it look more tidy again, a lot more homely. Um, so that's what I'm going to do very soon. Yeah. <laughs> oh, God, I have an itchy nose. Yeah. Um... Yeah, so I'm folding up my sports track seat thing right now. So usually when I put these in the wardrobe, like I put them in like a set. So obviously you probably, you'll see me put this down. To put... Okay, what was up to? Yeah, so usually well, how I hang thing, how I hang this thing up is, is that um, I'll put this on like a hanger set and then I'll put the pants inside it, if you know what I mean. You probably don't know what I mean, but you probably do, I don't know. But um, yeah, so they go in the wardrobe like so. Um, that's it. Mm, it smells so good as well. So usually it's like a cotton fresh, um, washing conditioner powder thing. Not powder, but like what fabric softener actually is what it's called. And it's like cotton fresh, and it smells so freaking good. Um, what's in store? Yes, more socks to put away. Oh my god. This time, these are these orange weird socks I was talking about. Um, yeah, I don't know why, guys. I forgot to like, bought TikTok leggings lying about. You know, like TikTok leggings, which I wore for like that video where I tested out like TikTok um, products. Well, I still got those lying about because even though like the butt leggings. They're still actually really comfy, so sometimes I'll still wear it around the house. Um, because they are the most comfiest things ever. So that's what. I'll... Very good. Okay, we're on the last stretch of putting the laundry away. So all you need to do now is sort the bed linen, new bed linen out. No, I can't speak today. And now I need to pull these jeans up. And then we should be, like, done with all this stuff. So. Um, yeah, these go in the drawer. <laughs> yeah. But yeah, that's all the laundry folded now, so it's um, looking very good. Okay, so there's like one odd sock here. Don't know, that, don't know where that belongs to. I'm sure I'll find somewhere, like a partner, who this belongs to, but... Yeah, but it's like watching this little stream of consciousness video, that's what it's called, I'm not sure. But yeah, it's been quite a good little video to film. I at least got my laundry folded now because I woke up today and I was like, oh my god, I've got so much stuff to do. How am I going to do all this stuff? But I thought, oh, well, I like filming videos, so I thought, well, if I film myself folding laundry away, then it'll get done more easier. Because that's what I found, like, usually when I vlog, like I do a time lapse of me like, I don't know, putting stuff away in drawers or a time lapse of me cleaning. And you will get it done more quicker because I like to film because I'm like filming myself doing it, if you know what I mean. But anyway, I better like to watching this little video. I know it's been a bit of a boring video, but um I just thought, you know what, I'm just gonna be real with y'all today and just fold stuff away, you know. Um but yeah, I'll see you guys in another video, which probably isn't going to be this. And yeah, I bet have a wonderful day. I'm going to get dressed now, get showered actually, because I still not showered yet. Get dressed and then start the day off. So, bye.